Welcome to another episode of Enchanting El Nido. I'm Mavic, a Pulit Island Resort Environmental Officer. Today, I'm taking you to a meet and greet with a fishy celebrity. Don't get starstruck, because this little orange guy starred in an award-winning movie. Do you know who I'm talking about? None other than Nemo! So grab your snorkeling gear and let's meet him up close and personal. Let's go! Nemo was a clown anemone fish. Anemone fishes are a subfamily of the damselfish family. They are found in the waters of the Indo-Pacific Ocean and the Red Sea. Anemone fish are so named because of their association with sea anemones. Each species of anemone fish is highly host specific, meaning each species will settle only in select species of anemone. The anemone fish gains its protection slowly. When it finds a suitable anemone to live in, it touches the anemone's tentacles over a period of several hours to days until it develops a layer of mucus that's resistant to the anemone's stings. This protection works with that anemone only. It'll get stung if it goes to another one. The anemone fish has a special relationship with the sea anemone. It eats the parasites living on the anemone and protects it from predators that might want to eat it and in return, the fish also gets protection and a place to live in. Did you know that all anemone fish are born males? It's true! Can you spot the female in this group? In a group living in one anemone, only the largest male changes sex to become the dominant female. The next largest male becomes her mate and only the two of them reproduce. If the female dies, her mate changes sex to become the new dominant female, and the next largest male moves up the hierarchy. Aren't anemone fish amazing creatures? To find out more about El Nido and Tai Tai's natural environment, do visit our website at www.elnidoenvironment.wordpress.com. That's all that we have for today. I hope that you join me next time in another episode of Enchanting El Nido. Bye!